about to pull up on your man's face like this. Mm-hmm. Hey guys, so well, we're back with another And it says, um, it says we're like 300 and something miles. We are on our way back to the city again. <laughs> um, Do you have a band-aid? Do I look like a nurse to you? <laughs> But, um, yeah, we're going to the city so I can take this lash class. Um, I look dead. We're gonna go to brunch when we get, oh, my God. See, people are so, yeah, so I'm tired. I'll probably check in with you guys when we get there because <laughs> I'm tired and I just had a, a skittle. <laughs> I'll just say that I had a skittle. If you know, you know. <laughs> To the city well we made it to brooklyn we're here for brunch and we were trying to figure out why everybody was beeping on the highway literally beeping their horns and then we look at the um update like the news update that iphone sends and biden is president okay biden period get us on track yeah we just literally got here i'm tired as hell as you guys can see i went to bed at three o'clock last night but i just love this side of brooklyn like the houses and shit like i just love this it looks like um the background of everybody hates chris <laughs> Stop. we're going to brunch and then we're gonna go back to the hotel tomorrow i have to be up at well, my freaking lash class isn't even really till 1 o'clock, so I have the morning to like just chill and relax, but I don't think we're really going to do much out here. We're just chilling. We're really not out here for anything. It's strictly business.
the building for my lash class. Um, it's kind of scary, but yeah, I'm gonna check in with you guys when I get in there because I can't find her and I'm getting annoyed. Hey you guys, so it is the next day. I was gonna check back in with you guys last night, but I was too tired. Um, I want to just give you guys some bits and pieces of what happened at the lash class. So I went to the lash class. I really liked it. My instructor was super nice. She was super sweet. Um, she was actually from, she's from the New York City area and she's actually done a lot of famous people's lashes as well. So, um, it was super cool just hearing like how she reached out to people in regards to like promos and doing stuff. And she like told us a lot, like she really like explained a lot to us i know for sure that when i first start like practicing on people i am definitely going to be doing sales like consistently um people love sales so why not so um i'm definitely going to be incorporating that once i start lashing so i just want to show you guys some of the stuff that i got when i was at the class so for starters i got a fan i'm kind of mad because the girl next to me she got a cuter fan than me she got like that mini fan that's on amazon like the real lash fan like she gave me a small fan to dry my client's lashes obviously um i got a mannequin head this is my practice okay guys remember this remember this face okay so that was that we got a handbook too but she emailed it to us too because some of the stuff she kind of left out she gave us a bunch of these rings these are for glue she recommended getting oval ones these are like the ones that tattoo artists keep like their ink in but she told us to get the oval ones because it's like it's it doesn't fall out as easy and then i got this bag and it's literally just a bunch of lash stuff um if you guys want to know what's inside of it just comment below but if from what you guys can see there's uh scissors there is lash trays there is there's tweezers there's pretty much everything in here uh, i'm not gonna like dive into this because honestly it's just too much stuff and i wanted to unbox this when i really start practicing but uh yeah that was pretty much it um it was really like a quick trip like i said it wasn't a long trip it was literally a business trip the airbnb sucked Regardless of the view, it sucks. Yeah, so your girl is supposed to be a lash tech. I am trying to think of a name. Comment some names below too. And this was the Casamigos that I got when I went down there. I was literally looking for the dark one. I hate the clear one. So I wanted to see if the dark one would be any smoother. It says no of a smooth vanilla finish. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> Wait, I think my turkey's on backwards. Not the chicken head. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know for holiday like a holiday party <laughs> it's late night target run oh those look good This is two for ten. Should I get two? Um, can I take this off? Hey guys, so I know this is kind of like all over the place, but I'm at the gynecologist. I'm in my room. Um, yeah, my forehead's breaking out. But yeah, I'm at the gynecologist. I'm getting my annual, and I just want to check in with you guys because yesterday I'm gonna tell you guys what went on. I just went to Target late night, and then um, I went to Target late night with my friend. We were supposed to go to Starbucks, but we ended up getting to Starbucks too late, and it was closed. So yeah, we just ended up going to Target, getting a couple things, and then yeah, that was pretty much my night last night. I'm about to go to Target again today because I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna try this Camila Rose. Um, conditioner I've been hearing a lot of good stuff about it my friend uses it too so I'm just gonna try it out on my hair because as you guys can see I have braids but I have super dry scalp my scalp gets super dry so I need something to like moisturize it keep it you know nice and moist and then I'm gonna run to the grocery store I think I'm gonna make empanadas tonight if I do I'll show you guys it's either between empanadas or spaghetti but I think I'm gonna end up making empanadas because it's quick and easy. But I think my doctor's coming, so I'll check in with you guys when I leave. 
hey guys so it's a couple days later um i've been doing really bad because as you can see my hair is looking old like it's been a minute since i got on camera um so last time you guys seen me um i don't even know so now i'm currently on my way to work um so I think I finally picked a lash name, but I don't want to tell you guys yet because I need to like, you know, secure it. So um, I'm going to wait until like I announce like what the name is and I get the Instagram page set up. But if you guys are entrepreneurs or like business owners, can you guys comment below and tell me some techniques to start in a business? It's 26 degrees right now and it's freaking freezing and my tire the air in my tires just i gotta give me some winter tires so has anyone updated their phone because literally i don't know why but like this is green dot it'll turn like green or yellow sometimes whenever i have my camera on or like even certain apps like it'll just be on and i wonder if this is the feds anyways but guys i am I'm gonna go into work this quality is just getting trasher and trasher because i'm in the garage so i'll see you guys when i get off of work so i am on my lunch break um and i didn't realize uh, my job be having views let me show you out this window so this is like literally a view at my job like literally views and look at the light oh period no, my response was, happens. That's what I said. <laughs> happens. I don't give a shit. Bro, he's licking my scalp. Good he's ah, licking my I scalp. Ah, I felt his tongue on my scalp, bro. <laughs> <laughs> no. You pick a date, on that date, I'm required Where can you to give out some Stock X. No, she picked the eighth of every month. Right. Mm, stock X. Good morning. <laughs> These braids look so bad now. Like, I didn't think they were going to look this bad this quick. How bad do they look on a scale of 1 to 10? Not bad. They look bad, bro. Why are you lying? So, it's Saturday. Um, It's my weekend off and i got monday off so it's about to be a good ass weekend um i'm at my friend's house i slept over here last night um we had sushi and wine and watched kevin hart i am about to get ready to leave in a second because i'm going to brunch with my other friends later so i'm gonna bring you guys with me then i look really raggedy my braids look so old i'm trying to like figure out how to style them so they don't look too crusty anymore but they look crusty crusty dusty um but yeah, we just woke up not too long ago. I'm like still kind of tired because I had so much wine last night and then I had these Skittles edibles. No, 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 no. The day's gonna go by quick. I feel like since the daylight saving shit, the day goes by way too quick. Literally way too quick. She better come in here, I'm about to be weak. Let me show you her badass dog. They're just bad. Like, and you stink. Why, why did you take him off the leash last night? I mean, he almost killed himself. Like, raggedy is understated, actually. I just look raggedy. These earrings are done, done up, done up. You know, like that costume jewelry, like when it gets old, it, you could tell it's like, it gotta go like that. But yeah, guys, we are gonna have a fun, productive Saturday. It's looking like it's gonna be a fun Saturday. Hopefully.
Exactly. So that's how you know. Take, take the cups. I'm supposed to be vlogging for my channel. So I'm getting some orange juice. I don't think that's not what they put in the middle, so. If I finish the first one, I'm going to take the one. She's better. She's better. That's better. What happened? Because mom, I was calling her because mom did it. You're right, you're right. No, mom is bonded. It's my car. Why didn't you tell me to get it? I was like, right where right, 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 right. Somebody literally took that park in the right, second yeah, I just spent the box. I knew it. I, knew it. I was so mad. So, you know, I'm not walking. Oh, yeah. But she was laughing at me. I was like, I don't care. Like, we <laughs> sat right there. I still have my car just the way it is. It wasn't even that mad, but it was like you could have parked better. Like, literally. Be <laughs> oh, like, well. I'm in. I'm in. in my shit. I, I tuck my, my mirror in. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good. Quinn's just so embarrassing. Every time. Quinn's embarrassing. Why you be parking crazy? Quinn's is no. Quinn's. Oh, yeah. And then they push it. They pull off right when you're about to get out. Yeah, right when they're about to get out. What kind of emotions do you guys have? We have oh. apple cider, pineapple. Um, we have a Tennessee mimosa, which has orange juice and a kind of shot of Jack Daniels. I think I want that one. Like, is it too strong? Like, is it overpowered? Because she said it has a shot in it. No, get the uh, Jack Daniels. You trying to get it? Get a cup. I would say Jack Daniels. You don't like that liquor. It's like a dark liquor. Right. Oh no. You know, dark it's liquor. like a whiskey, right? right? Yeah. No. Okay, I'll get, get the original. Or the classic. The classics, yeah. Or the apple cider. So I seen the cinnamon French toast. Is that like, uh, like do you guys make it? Yeah, we just like homemade. Homemade, okay. That's why I said don't play them. They they Ooh. do they can. <laughs> okay, because I thought it was like, you know, the ones in the freezer bag. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm not the yellow one. Like, I'm like kind of stiff. I don't like them really well, too big. Like but also, I just can't eat it with seasoning or cheese. Like, I'm ghetto. I want it with sugar. <laughs> no, literally. That's what I'm saying. It's too fancy. Yeah. So, okay, you're going to walk over. It looks good, but I know I'm not going to like the grits. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, you're gonna do a chicken and yeah, waffles? You get wings, and wings. I want you to get that too. I know, you gotta get a mimosa. No, you took the same amount as us. So I'm gonna say it's gonna this. I will, I want you to do more. Oh, you did drink some wine. She drank wine before she came. I drank my whole cup of wine. You sure? I drank wine before No, she drank wine before she got to oh. my house. And she's dead ass good. <laughs> so I'm gonna let you be. Oh, she said, I'm gonna let you be. <laughs> Let's take a I'm, video, guys. I'm vlogging right now for my YouTube. Oh, we're talking. Really? We're just talking. <laughs> Can we do a podcast? Yeah, we we'll should. Can so we do a podcast? We really would like. <laughs> we would. Yeah, this is what older people do about too. Like, yeah. This is what I aspire to be like a white. Five and six o'clock. I'll do. I'll do three if I can compromise. Just do it all night. Yeah. Maybe three. I'm going to brunch with my friends. I'm going to brunch with my friends. Simple. Where's my glossy glossy? I don't have it. The, the one is my pocket. Oh, I got an on So what should I get with my French toast? Do you guys do like the whole, it looks like a lot of different pieces. So it's a half chicken. You modify that, right? Unfortunately, no, we portion it all out. You can get boneless chicken. What if the waffles aren't good? But the waffle only gives, no, they're it's so good. Waffle they're so fine. Okay, okay. okay I'm good. You can answer. Like, yeah, like, um, hello. <laughs> But then I like she called me, so I'm like, okay, I gotta go to a little more detail then. He's good. You be on your old lady shit for real. That's what Lon always says, like her taste buds is old as so old. So old. Pistachios. Yeah, I have like them chicken seeds like a month ago. Yeah, like, those are good too. I like those. No, because I have them at work. You know she'll be hidden at work. Anything you see here now. Anything you see like. Eh? And move to our kind of whatever. We live in for like three months. Oh, wow. It's not bad. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh, those chairs look nice. Aww. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Um, yes, please. Do you have hot sauce? Yeah, we do. And then we Okay, thank you. Yeah, can I have a sign out for Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, let me get any small plates out of the way for you. Oh, yeah, I'm not. Take the queen. No, that's yours. Can I put it on my lunch? I have to. Go to bed. Wait, I know that's how you go. Yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. 
It's bad. I can show you. So we're not serving brunch anymore. Is this all your drinks right here? No, so Do you guys um, have an apple cider mimosa? This is our um, full cocktail menu. And then we have a wine list as well. What is that the bar? Table, right? No, table. no, table. table. Yeah. Okay. I'll have you guys scan for the menu and that paper list so I can pull out your camera and just hover over it. <laughs> elevate, elevate. Only obligation is to tell it straight. So much on my plate, I gotta delegate. Say hi to the camera, Miles. <sighs> oh God. <sighs> We're back home. <laughs> Say hi, Miles. Oh my God, I'm out of breath. <laughs> Are you serious? They rolled over, so. <sighs> Hopefully they didn't break. Because if they broke, I would like, fuck this. You good? You ate? Who? You. Ate. Ate. <laughs> Sweetheart. I'm done. Where's the remote? I don't know. Stop! So you just stripped in here? Like, I'm confused. <laughs> You're a joke! <laughs> a fucking joke. Go. You don't like? Can you only smash those out your head? Yeah, might as well. It's right to the back of the tiny house cabin. Uh, whenever you're walking uh, down, <laughs> as well, it matches the path. The views from this fire pit area are killer, though. You can see the river, built this tiny house all themselves, and I think they did a wonderful job. Can Starting with the deck that wraps around. Bro, you keep picking the same ones I watched already. Right? You're not even watching them. Oh my god. My hair looks. I'm taking this shit out today. Today, like what? There's no middle part. Whoa! Every time I feel something touch my leg, I think it's miles. I can't even remember that much of the morning yesterday. There was no morning. <laughs> and I think I don't know where I put my Invisalign. I know I took it out yesterday, but I don't remember where I put it. And I already lost the bottom. I put a long ass with them. My hair looks like shrimp. Oh, just on this waffle. Hold on. Okay, guys. Good. So, I am in Marshalls. It's a couple days later. I don't know if you guys can hear me, but it's a couple days later. I am at Marshalls because I'm trying to find a planner. To get my life together. I need a planner to find a planner, and that's it. We're not getting nothing else even though I'm in the section where I already see myself being tempted. I had a dream last night that I was in Marshalls. So this would kind of be deja vu if you think about it, because I'm here again today. And I lost my freaking Invisalign at brunch, guys. I am so upset. Oh my God, they have Kapari here, the deodorant. So um, yeah, like I said, I lost my freaking Invisalign at brunch. So I have to get a new one, but I'm thinking to just wait and get a new one because I have to, um, I have to get my wisdom teeth pulled out. So I'm just going to wait pretty much. I'm going to wait until, um, 
that comes up and then I'll just get a new Invisalign. Yeah, let's see if I can get in and out of here in like 10 minutes without getting anything that I didn't come here for. Just never know like cute cleaners here. This one's actually kind of cute. And I seen it last time I came here, but I didn't like that it doesn't have the months and the weeks on here. But this is what it says. It says power planning. Inside of it looks like this. I'll show you guys. So this is it. It's really thick. And you would think as thick as it is, it would have like a lot to offer. But it's literally like this is all it consists of. Like it's all the same exact page. So I don't know. I kind of want it, but then I kind of don't. I don't like that. I really don't. I mean, this is cute, but it's not what I need. Guys, so I actually ended up finding a planner. The other, this other customer that was in there looking for planners too, she was like, there's actually planners over here. Did you see them? I'm like, wow. It was like a bunch of hidden gems in the back. So I found a planner. It's so cute. And the inside of it is like, it's thick. Like this, that's what I wanted. I wanted a thick planner. So. Ooh, okay guys, so I'm back. It's a little later, I'm hot. These lights are making me hot. I can't, I can't. Okay, Um, it's a lot later actually. This is my planner I meant to show you guys. It's super cute, but I wanted to show you guys what else I got in the mail. I'm waiting for a couple other things. Oh my gosh, we ain't about to do this today. Okay, boom, there we go. My braids are looking crazy. I know they're coming out tomorrow, so don't come for me. I wanted to close this vlog out the right way because I haven't been closing my vlogs out or I'll just dip out on y'all. So I wanted to show y'all a couple of things. I got a package. Um, I ordered shoes and then I got a special package. I was gonna, I wasn't gonna unbox this. Um on camera but i just felt like it was needed because your girl worked hard for this okay we worked real hard <sighs> anyways so like i was saying um i just felt like i needed to come on camera to unbox the second thing that i'm about to show you guys so i'm gonna show you guys the shoes that i got because i'm really hoping they fit because they're gonna go right back baby okay if they don't fit they're gonna go right back this is the box that came in and I might be about to be like, oh, what's inside of it? It's shoes. We're just going to unbox this. And it came so quick. I ordered this last Thursday on Monday. What was that? So, these shoes are from Steve Madden, of course. Yeah, I know I love me some Steve Madden. Good ass quality. But honey. Honey. It's giving, okay? Look at this. This is like a nice latex. Like, if y'all don't know, I love thigh high boots. Like, especially for this time, because it's like winter, fall. These are just so bomb. Like, what? I'm hoping they fit because I have really uh, thick thighs and. I didn't want to get an 8. They didn't have half sizes. I didn't want to get an 8 because I was scared my thighs, like I said, my thunder thighs wouldn't fit inside the boot. So, let's cross our hands. This fits, girl. So, I'm about to try on one because if the other one doesn't fit, it's clip. Woo, I just felt my ankle move a freaking scary ass way. From what's going on right now, the 9 was a good choice because the sole is actually tight. Okay? It's actually really tight, so I'm glad I didn't get an eight and a half because I would have really been crying. Like I said, I have thunder thighs. Well, not even thighs, like thunder calves. And they are kind of in need of CPR right now because they're suffocating. But it's okay because beauty's pain. Like, um boats. Yeah, so I think I think the sides is fine. I just have to wait for this part to get like you know more stretch here and work on my calves because if they were any bigger if i got a size any bigger they'd be looking like bolts on my feet so yeah these are the shoes i'm not gonna try on the other one because that was just way too much work so these are how they look I'm about to pull up on your man's face like this mm-hmm comment below how you can stretch out the thigh parts so um 
Oh, oh my god. Let me come back. Okay, so the next thing that I didn't necessarily get, I earned it. Okay, I didn't order it, I earned it. Is my college diploma. It finally came in the mail, which I'm so happy about. So we're just gonna unbox that. I'm trying not to show you guys my address, that's why I'm like going so slow. Uh -huh. Okay, so this is how it came in like this little white envelope. Oh, and they put like they put like this shield glass over it. Okay. Okay, and then they put like this tissue paper on top of it to like you know make sure the ink doesn't smear. <sighs> I just want to thank God. I want to thank me. I want to thank me for believing in me. I want to thank me for doing all this hard work. I want to thank me for having no days off. I want to thank me for, for never quitting. I want to thank me for always being a giver and trying to give more than I receive. I want to thank me for trying to do more right than wrong. I want to thank me for just being me at all times. Oh, and this is my diploma. Your girl is officially a college grad. I mean, I already graduated, but this is the real deal. This is my college diploma, and I earned it, and I deserve 50 pats on my back because I did that. Those were some hard-ass years, some crazy-ass years, and I did it, and I'm so proud of myself. Um, I could honestly say that, even though I'm still trying to figure out what I'm doing in my life. It's okay because we finished the first obstacle and I'm just like, damn, like, I really did that. Like, I really did that. And these lights are not trying to let me be great because it's literally like taking the shine from the real shine. Hello. Yeah, guys, I'm just, I'm so proud of myself. Um, this is like, literally like this little piece of paper put me through hell. You know that stay from commercial when it'd be like the guy holding the dollar and he's holding the fisher rod and he'd be like you gotta be quicker than that oh you almost had it you gotta be quicker than that yeah that's literally how this diploma has felt like just to get it like i had to fight for this shit because colleges they be they be some grimy motherfuckers like they really don't want to see you win and that's that's coming from a college student personally like i want to really tell you guys like you can literally do anything you put your mind to no matter how hard it is no matter how much time it takes just think of it this way you got all the time in the world like you don't have all the time in the world let me rephrase that don't don't waste a day like don't waste today and i actually have that as my screensaver i'm gonna show you guys and that's actually my screen saver you guys can't really see it but don't waste today don't let a day go by where you don't make yourself better in some way it doesn't matter what it is don't waste today don't be sitting around thinking that shit's gonna come to you magically one day because people who are doing good in life it's because they got up off their ass and they did it so if i could do it you could definitely do it okay there's no excuses you don't deserve no excuses it doesn't matter what your story is you deserve everything that you want so why not go get it so um yeah even though i absolutely hated college and um I really, I feel like I did go for the wrong reasons. I definitely did go for the wrong reasons. But it was like an obstacle that I think I needed to get to where I'm at now. I know that I have the ability to do anything that I put my mind to because that right there, I had to literally put my mind, my heart, and my soul into school because I've never been somebody who loves school. Like, that's just never been me. Like, I'm not going to sit here in front and be like, oh, I was the best student in high school. No. It literally took me till the end to really, like, be like, all right, girl, you got to get your shit together because you're just going to be throwing money out the window, giving these people more money, and it's like, what, what are you benefiting in the end? Like, ask yourself that if you're ever in a situation where you're like, 
you're not giving something your all, ask yourself that. What am I benefiting from that? What am I going to benefit from in the long run? I guarantee you, you'll come up with a solution quick because that's how I was. Like, I had to come up with something quick because time was just going because that's what time does. It keeps going. You can do anything that you want. Just don't second guess yourself. Don't doubt yourself. Don't don't play about you like you you are the most important person in your life remember that besides god you are the most important person to you but i don't want to keep ranting um i want to i wanted to close out this vlog in a positive note because you know i'll be i'll be going through my own little things i'll be going through my own little things and y'all see that but um i really wanted to end this vlog on a positive note because i love you guys and i want you guys to watch every video and be like and be able to relate to me because, you know, nobody has perfect days every single day. So, you know, you need to be able to have time where you could just de-stress and understand that life isn't easy and shit gets rough. Like, shit is not always peaches and cream. So, um, don't think that your problems are less important than anybody else's problems because they don't seem as big. Because, you know, we all go through our own thing. Um, I'm probably going to take my ass to bed yeah i look like a grease ball so i'm probably gonna give myself a freaking mask actually um tell me what you guys think of those shoes tell me what you guys think tell me if i sh what, ch what what i could do to stretch the leg part out because they're super tight and i do not like that um but yeah i'm about to do what i do um i love you guys so much and i'll see you guys in my next video bye